guys, it's D-Man 10 here, and today, um, just a little bit earlier today, today is Tuesday, October 12th, that Green Poison was released, um, by the Chronic Dev Team. Um, with this jailbreak, I'm not going to tell you the devices, I'm just going to update down below all the devices, um, that are available, because I don't want people watching the video and they get confused what devices are and are not available, and they might add more devices like the iPod Touch 2G which I have. But I'm just going to show you real quick how do you get um how do you get a uh, green poison? So you're just going to go to your web browser, go to green poison. This last zero, uh, the last o is spelled with a zero. Dot com. Have this all in the description. Okay. Now once you get to greenpoison.com, um it's just going to have a little green skull. And it just shows you that it's made by the Chronic Dev Team. Um, now, the Mac link doesn't work right now. But, of course, I'll put an annotation when it does, and I'll update you down below, obviously. Um, I'm just going to download for Windows. i save the file. And it's already done. I'm just going to open it up. It'll open up the application. And it's going to actually prompt you to put your device into DFU mode. Now, if you don't know how to put your device into DFU mode, what you're going to do, take your device, and you're going to hold down the power button. Well, first shut it off. It's a little easier doing it that way. So you just shut your device off. Slide the power off. Just wait till it's done shutting off. So make sure your screen is completely black. Okay, my device is off. Now, what you're gonna do is you're gonna hold the, the power button and the home button for 10 seconds. So just count down with me. I'm not gonna do this, but um, I'll show you what happens. One, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now release the power button. Keep holding the home button for until the thing tells you um, to prompt you that it's done. So in here, as you can see on the screen, it gives you directions what to do if you didn't understand what I just showed you. And uh, if you mess up, you can just reset, and it'll go to the back to the beginning. And then the um, basically the program's just gonna wait for you to go. In, into DFU mode, it's going to load the bar, and then um, it's going to hit, there's a button that's going to pop up here that says jailbreak, and it's just going to jailbreak, and um, yeah, it just goes through the process, downloads the jailbreak for you, um, and there are white letters that scroll down the screen, that's verbose boot, if you don't know what that is, um, it's just telling you that um, the jailbreak is, it's um, changing files and stuff on your, on your iPod, so it allows you to have Cydia and Loader. Now, Loader is new. I've never seen Loader before. Loader, you open it up. It's kind of like Black Rain, how they had that black, like, uh, drop icon. And what the, the drop icon, or now it's called Loader, you open up Loader and you can install Cydia. And which Cydia just brings you the normal jailbreak programs and uh, tweaks and stuff like that. So, um, if you guys like this, please give me a thumbs up. I'm sorry I don't have a um an earlier device um that was just out but um i kind of only have the ipod touch 2g and i like it because it's easy to jailbreak you don't really are you don't have to wait for anything you could always jailbreak on any firmware you really want to so um i don't really have the money for it but um i'm sure i'll get a new uh i'm thinking about getting the iphone if it comes up for rise in the future um but thanks for watching guys um thumbs up on this video Subscribe for more jailbreak updates and videos and tech uh, tech program videos and anything you want. Um, thanks so much for watching. Please subscribe.